Pindah ke lain So in this series, we will call it the Tech Blog. So what is a Tech Blog? So before I have a Tech Tips episode, so which is focus on yung mga tips, especially on the beginners, how to start their uh, IT or troublesho basic troubleshooting. Uh, technique on computers or network so in this series we will talk on how uh, things done in this blog we will have method by method video on how to solve things so it is uh, it is different from the tech tips because uh, tech tips have a solution so this one we will have a journey on uh, what this problem or what are the problems or and how to solve it so it not necessarily at the end of the video there is a solution so maybe it will have will take uh, every uh, will take many parts or many episodes to be complete so this tech video is called the server vlog episode so in this server blog episode, we will talk about first a problem with server fans. So how can we identify what problem of the server are? So first thing we can find is the LED indicator in front of the server. So there are LED indicators there that uh, basically uh, give us an insight on what are the server problem or what are the problems that our server is uh, facing so for example in this video we'll have the fun so how can uh, how we did uh, uh, how we come up with the fun problem so the first thing uh, we encounter is the high speed fan so nagtaka may pag boot ng server or during ano pag ano namin mataas yung noise high speed siya so full speed yung fans fans so ipapakita ko sa inyo later on kung paano siya kalakas from the usual speed <coughs> So this means there is a problem either in temperature or the fan itself check the temperature room so it is uh, the temperature is good so it is cold and there is no any heat or uh, uh, high level uh, high temperature in the place so the second thing so we had a list of uh, guidelines on the led lights so we have the pattern uh, we have that list so that we can easily find what is the pro what are the problems are
So, yun na, lumabas sa ano sa front uh, rear part ng server na yung fan. So, nag-amber light siya or nag-light. Ito yung itsura niya nung nalaman namin na fan ang problema. So, this one. Then, so we had it open so in open namin connect namin yung server fan so basically ang default na fan ng IBM X3500 is just like a cassette so malaking cassette siya so ito yung itsura then it has three three slotted na fans so it composes the up upper pan the middle and the bottom and then Meron siyang tatlong redundant fans sa likod. So, the server can uh, the fan can load up up to 6 redundant fans. So, ano siya yung simple swap shot, it means you can pull out or pull in another another fans if uh, while the server is running, just like the hot swap in the hard disk. Pero hindi siya advisable kasi syempre the fans are spinning while the server is running then bigla mo siyang ipa-plug out so hindi siya maganda i don't know how it uh, how it will work but kami hindi namin siya ginaw ah tinry namin kaysa pero yun nakita namin na parang hindi siya magandang ano kasi ba masira so i don't, I don't know how is the correct uh, use of that pero basically may six fan siya so, yun, nagtataka kami. Ang malakas na yung blow ng lapta ay ng, ano, ng fan. And then, the server led uh, indicates that the fan is has damage. Either the rotation speed of the fan are slow or the other fans are not working. But, pag-check namin, umiikot naman yung fan dalawa. And then, so we tried out to ha add two more two more fans for the upper and the middle uh, bottom the middle part fan you can also put in but uh, it is uh, focus on if you have a second uh, CPU so the server can have two CPUs but that server is uh, only have one at the moment so yun, we tried it to, to put the two server uh, the two fans in the redundant mode back uh, besides the no, the original fan and we try it to swap or another combination that it could work but it's not so ayun. so we try to search in in the internet on how to fix that one pero malit konti lang yung solutions na nano so ang isang na lang way na uh, ginawa namin uh, ginagawa namin na ipapalabas ko on the second episode of this video is the update of the firmware and the drivers so may nakita siya kung isang post na in-update nila yung uh, in-update nila yung firmware so na now I will show you how we did it so here we go. So this is the fan we ordered. So these two fans is either an upgrade or replacement. So the testing natin kung uh, pwede ba siyang upgrade or idadagdag or replacement talaga. So these fans cost up up to 12,900 pesos each. So this is a modular fan or shall we say a simple swap fan. Let's go. Let's go.
So where, when we clean the fan, you should uh, put any stopper on the fans itself because uh, too much uh, speed or too much rotation can damage the fans. So before you use it a blower or uh, any device for cleaning, you should uh, put any stopper on the fan. <laughs> so this is how you pluck out a fan so just pull out the blue uh, violet switch then you can uh, pull out the fan yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So to put back in, you should uh, see the the connector beside it, then push it uh, downwards. So be careful in uh, pressuring the pan.
like a bit more cereal then color sabay and sabay yeah ako ko din
watching guys. Hopefully, meron kayo natutunan sa vlog na ito. Especially those who are network administrator or uh, handling uh, those uh, IT or any IT related courses na may job na regarding sa servers. So, this is the first episode of the server series of the tech blog. So, this is the Twixter. I'm out.